Nice. All right, first fish, here we go. Salmon? Getting him out of the water is going to be the thing. He's moving around a bit. Up over the ledge. Down, down, down. Here he comes. <laughs> Benito. Yeah, that's a good size Benito. You asked for it, you got it. Take that back for Claudio. Oh, that's nice. Should be stoked. All right, I'm straight out. Okay, okay we only caught the one Benito skillion. Uh, a couple of days previously, I caught a uh, Murray Cox. So I'll have a quick look at that. And then we out at the entrance. 48, something like that. Come on. And... Nice. And there he goes. Morning, all right, it's the next day. It's about six o'clock in the morning. It's, weather's looking a bit bleak, but we'll just come down to the, I don't even know. The entrance. The entrance. And uh, yeah, it's gonna flick the double clutch. Scott's gonna flick a bent minnow. See if we can find a flathead. We've only got an oh, hour, hour and a half. But uh, yeah, give it a quick whirl. Beautiful around here, really nice. All right, well I'm on. There's a small tailor busting up everywhere. Doesn't get much fishier than this. Yep. Taylor, heaps of them busting up, smashing bait. All right, I'll get that out of that guy and get back into it. He's gone. Away. Nice. Get the pliers handy, I think. Yep, straight on. Landed on his head, I think. A little bit better, this one. Oh, bait fish swimming past me. You're on as well. <laughs> well, they may be little, but at least they're fun. Have you? Nice. Little guy. Mine's coming in sideways. Double banger. <laughs> yeah, well, there's little bait fish swimming past me, school of them. Fish going nuts.
Yep. Oh, yep. Uh, I think the, the lure just gets stuck on the side of their head and they come in sideways a bit. Oh, he's off. Perfect. G'day, mate. Yeah. Well, the tide's still coming in. It's uh, like last hour or whatever, coming into high tide, so everything's pushing in. Yep. This pelican wants a piece of the action. Pelicans are lazy, hey. Like there's fish everywhere out there and he's, he's here, he wants this one. Yeah. There you go, circle of life. So he's got uh, a bit of fishing line hang hanging off his head. I bet he's got a hook in his mouth somewhere. All right, he's happy. It's so nice here, eh? Birds, bang, bang, birds everywhere. So I guess at low tide you could, you could probably wade right out there, eh? Yep. I haven't had a hit for it. <laughs> oh, now. <laughs> yeah, this one was just like directly in front of me.
Too slow, mate. <laughs> and it's got top. Such a shit tailor season up on the Gold Coast. I don't think they made it up. I think they've come this far and that's it. <laughs> Oops, that, right, so it's got called a flathead. Not a whopper, but probably 38. 38, 40, something like that. So that was all right. May have lost a bit of footage. Oh yeah. <laughs> Come on. No, 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 no. Are you a pelican or a pelican? So yeah, what have I got on here? The double clutch, the laser AU. Oh. Who wants it? Gone. Don't drop it, mate. <laughs> hey? Yeah, I threw it to him. Down it goes. Oh, so it's got called a flathead. Not a whopper, but probably 38. 38, 40, something like that. So that was all right. May have lost a bit of footage. Oh yeah. <laughs> Old mate's got one on as well. So yeah, this system alive. is uh, absolutely alive with uh, with fish <laughs> and all sorts of things. The little tailor he's got as well. Cool. Keep going. Work away along a little bit so we can find the flathead. So I was talking to the local guy picking up the rubbish there, and uh, yeah, he was saying really good whiting in here. Good flathead as well. They do well on the soft plastics apparently. Um, also the little birds, the little terns that are, were diving in the water. All this has been fenced off for their nesting ground. They're very endangered apparently, so people are uh, crushing their eggs. So yeah, they fenced the big area off so the terns can breed, which is a good thing. And, um, yeah, this would be a great place to come back to, I think. You can see the terns diving in the water over here. Just the choppers moving around, but yeah, every now and then little schools of bait fish, just little fish moving through. Really impressed with this area. This is the entrance. We've stayed up at Nora Head last night and yeah, fish down the Skilly and down at uh, Terrigal. 
last night. Just had the one bonito. But um, yeah, just a really nice area. Very, very fishy. So much area to explore, like a, a kayak or whatever, just paddling around. You'd just be killing them. Just awesome. Had a couple of hits from the tailor, but um, not quite as frantic as it was 15 minutes ago. Really just searching for flathead. Okay, so I just got snagged up. Rock or something out the middle there. Uh, not going to retire a leader, that's it for me. I've only got about 15 minutes left, so it's got to get something, I'll film that. Otherwise, we're just going to make our way back and that'll probably be the end of the video. Thanks for watching, it's been really good here. And um, yeah, till right. next time, see you later.